Who is your favorite character so far? I think myself and a lot of people included are gonna say Samurai Girl. Hands down. She is so cool. The way her hair turns all white and does a crazy Samurai Slash. She's a bit dumb though. Maybe not dumb. Naive, ignorant, or pure. She's from like a different era or like a different place entirely. Now our main character seems a little bit OP. He's hiding it pretty well. There's something going on. There's a little bit of a secret. Why does he have a bodyguard place around there? What's up with his brother? Something's off here. Let's begin today's reaction. I'm not gonna be able to remember any of their names, man. They all have white names, so yeah. I don't know how I feel about this guy. He's so... I mean, I can't really say immature because they're kids, but god damn, like, try to be a little bit friendly, man. Sociopath. Fucking sociopath. <laughs> Ain't nobody way. Ain't no way I'm waking up that early. What? A sword? A katana? What do you know want for, man? Oh yeah, we, we did do that. The scars? But what are we gonna learn? Because everybody uses swords, though. Sword arts. What about this is magic? I get I get, it's magic swords, right? But it's like Oh, we got a wand! We're gonna learn how to do magic! First class of swordsmanship. P. <laughs> oh, this purple hair guy. But oh, Okay, they're shitting on him for being ordinary. I still don't like Pete's personality, though. I don't like the fact that they're looking down on him for being ordinary, but he just comes off so fucking annoying, right? I'm sure he's gonna have proper, like, character development. And, like, he won't be so annoying. It's just... Bro such a little bro. Ooh. She's stepping up. First impressions are everything. I mean, she did leave a first impression. I'm not sure if everybody saw her take down the, the troll. Oh. This guy finally making a move. Last episode, all he did was just like make angry faces. I love the fact that Asia is just Asia with a Z instead here, though. I think he's gonna get humiliated, man. Like, you should. Ah! This guy's gonna get fucked, dude. Oh? You instead. Trying to protect her. <laughs> A connection, bro. <laughs> yeah, he was. There's still the mystery of the girl that casted the spell on the girl to run a troll, right? Wonder where she's at. But if we waited then, what would have happened? True! Talk your shit! Ojo-sama, oh, you're going in? Oh shit. Yo, those curls are gonna slap him up. <laughs> I hope he's not just some shitty ass villain. I want him to be a good character too. But yeah, it does seem like there's a little bit something between them. Now, when did we actually use the wand though? I mean, this is swordsmanship class. Ah. Cool. The... That's, that's pretty convenient. A mortal blow? Well, it can't be lethal, but mortal blow? <laughs> I, I guess the moment it taps the head or chest, it would be a mortal blow, if not for the spell. Therefore, it's a mortal blow. Yeah, I get it. Okay. You shouldn't go easy on her, man. Exactly. I love how her hair changes every time. Gravity magic? The recovery speed! She's using two hands. Oliver's still only using one, except here to guard. She's still one-handed, why? Okay, I see this animation! Oh! This is pretty good, right? The soundtrack, the animation, the quality put into this battle. 
I think it's a lot better than the shit we've seen in the recent seasons. So many. Probably countless people. Huh? What? Why is she crying? Is the fight making her remember something? Give her a mortal blow then end the battle. <laughs> oh, two-handed now, finally. I'm a bit confused as to what she's remembering or seeing. Okay, one, of you, one of you don't die. <laughs> you, you don't actually die! What would have happened there? But I thought your magic would prevent, you know, lethal blows. Oh, you can break it. I guess we did see like a different purple aura going around, right? Well, this is a good first impression to the rest of the class, you know, like, this shit is real. Well, I don't know. Maybe Richard Andrews is next level too. Ah! Based on this look though, probably not. What? No! Fight him! Clap his ass! Coward. I'm still confused as to what Nanao saw. He said here, during the fight, he started crying. Was she remembering something of the past? Did, her, did his swordsmanship like remember, like remind her of something? That was tears of fulfillment? She was so happy there was someone that could keep up with her? Yeah, we did get blue balled. What life beyond that moment is a fucking lethal blow! <laughs> no! Y'all would have died! She's... I don't think... Oliver's too into it though, look at this. What was this? Because he doesn't want her to cry? You were crying. And he said he doesn't want to see her cry. Yeah. <laughs> She's like, I want to see what lies beyond this moment, bitch. <laughs> One of you was about to die. You want to die? Maybe something beyond that isn't that, but I don't know. She's a little... She, I, I don't even know, man. She's kind of crazy. Look at her teeth. Like a shark. That sounds kind of fucked up. Exploit them? I don't think she'd be too into it. I don't know. Are they really cute? I would expect her to be the best. He's not very good, is he? Bill on the fifth. Isn't she super talented and gifted at this? Interesting that she's struggling. I don't know. She doesn't want any of them to die. Right? Right, gotcha. That makes a lot more sense. If she really wanted to rush it, then she would have been done quicker, right? She is so empathetic towards everything. Even the troll that almost killed her. Oh! No! <laughs> she got some crying now, dude! She can't, though. Oh. I mean, the biology teacher literally said, you know, exploit all these resources. Hmm. Yeah, it does sound like she comes from a really sheltered environment. <laughs> you must become corrupt. <laughs> Is that what you're saying? Yeah, I mean, she has to, like, hold on to her ideals. Okay. Oh, oh not like that. She's getting rizzed up. <laughs> hey, it's our public fountain faith. She's not in there right now, no? It's her again. She won't show her face, though. What do you look like? 
I think she's super special. Even if she can't kill anything, I think she can do different things that no one else can. Win is the brother, right? Hmm? The labyrinth encroaches. What does that mean? Oh, no, no. I want to see this labyrinth thing. The labyrinth. So the school just becomes a maze at nighttime. The fuck? Okay. Did no one else tell us about this? Like, the students were not aware. Hmm. Upperclassmen? Wait, who is... But maybe it's a fairy. They did mention some kind of fairy. I like her voice. Oh. Is this gonna be like a MILF character, maybe? Who is... Oh. Oh. There's another person there. Is she? Oh, upper class! Fourth year. God damn, look at this outfit. <laughs> what the fuck? But, Salvador... I, be, I guess it's like a really... Oh, that's the point B, Bobby. But I, I guess he's like an important person from like a Salvador family. What is she sending? It's like... Uh, I, I don't, something to like attract people. What are these like purple spores, man? She just emits like... <laughs> Basically, her body odor gets spread and then people become attracted to her. <laughs> oh, you can refuse it. Yo, Abby just head over heels over her. <laughs> you know I'll be on the fucking ground right now. But, okay, that's that's a shame. Bye-bye. <laughs> Another upper class? Or... Who are you? He looks a little bit too old for being an upper class. Man. Never mind. Fifth year. Are, are, aren't they supposed to... I thought upper classmen were patrolling around to help people that were stuck. But <laughs> why does it feel like they're trying to fight us? What the fuck? Go to the mommy. Go to the mommy. And cliffhanger. Pretty cool that we have so many different classes. We have like swordsmanship. And then there's like pure magic where I, I don't think she likes swords at all. There's like biology class. And the school becomes a labyrinth at night. Why? I have no fucking clue. But these upperclassmen who I thought were patrolling save the people. The new juniors that just came in. Nah, they're not here to save us. They're here to fucking fight us. What? Why? I don't know. But it's getting a little bit interesting. But if you're still here though, if you did enjoy this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlists for even more content. And until next time, take care.